Hi, Brady Barrows here with the RRDI, and I'd like to talk to you about the gallery. Uh, the Envision community platform allows us to have a gallery where members can post images. Now you would think with over 1,400 members we would have at least 1,400 images of rosacea, but alas, our members are quite shy and in the last several years rarely post and pretty much keep to themselves. And I think they're concerned about privacy. So we've taken a few steps to improve our privacy here at the RRDI. But I'd like to discuss this subject with you and let you think about it some, about this area of the gallery, which could really be something worthwhile for rosacea sufferers. There are papers that are coming out about computer-aided diagnosis using artificial intelligence to improve the quality of diagnosing rosacea. Most of these papers are really coming out of China, who are way ahead of us on diagnosing skin conditions using computer-aided AI, artificial intelligence. For example, one paper on this subject says the following, quote, Although computer-aided diagnosis is used to improve the quality of diagnosis in various medical fields, such as mammography and colonography, it is not used in dermatology, where non-invasive screening tests are performed only with the naked eye and avoidable inaccuracies may exist. This same paper concluded, quote, lastly, unlike previous studies, our method provides a solution to classify multiple diseases within a single image. With higher quality and a larger quantity of data, it will be viable to use state-of-the-art models to enable the use of CAD in the field of dermatology. As we've reported, we have a report that misdiagnosis occurs with rosacea patients. And can you see how we need to improve diagnosing rosacea and how gallery images of rosacea would really help? The Australia uh, New Zealanders uh, at Dermnet New Zealand has an archive of skin disease information using images from patients of dermatologists in New Zealand who've gathered over 15,000 images of different skin conditions, including rosacea. Now notice what the top 10 categories of skin conditions, which one is on the top? Look at this. So just think about it. If the RRDI could just get one image from each member, we'd have 1,400 rosacea images. And that might be worth their gold, worth their weight in gold for improving diagnosing rosacea. We would have data about this. So maybe you're shy and reluctant to post your photo of, of your rosacea. There are ways to block your eyes so that your identity can be masked. And please watch our video on rosaceans helping rosaceans. Think about it. Think about volunteering for the RRDI. Thanks for listening.